Hello all. Today we will try to create an application which and will implement a face recognition by using OpenCV. By using face recognition, we'll try to unlock that particular application. Now, when I say unlocking a particular application, we are not creating a full page application, but instead uh, we'll try to open a webcam and we'll train our model with our faces by using OpenCV. And then when there is a highly confidence more than 75%, then the application will automatically open or it will at least dis display a message saying that the application is successfully open. Now, to begin with guys, first of all, uh, the first step that I'm going to do, and one more very important thing about this is that we will try to, I'll try to capture the training data in front of you only in this particular video, and then we'll train that. And you will be seeing that by using this OpenCV LBH face recognizer, which is a face recognizer which is provided in OpenCV. This is very, very good because the training usually will be taking very less amount of time because we are going to convert that images into arrays and that particular array values will be trained uh, into this particular LBH face recognizer. We'll just try to uh, discuss about LBH face recognizer, which is already provided in OpenCV. So before that, I'm going to create some training data. Uh, while creating training data, what I'm going to do is that, first of all, I'm going to use the casket classifier and I have this hard casket frontal face default.xml, which will be able to capture the face features. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to just take each and every frame. And this is this, this whole block of code is actually creating the training data. So what I'm going to plan to do is what I'm planning to do is that I'll take 100 frames of my images and I'll store it in a folder. Later, those images, I'll be taking it, I'll be training with my, uh, with my LBP, LBPH face recognizer, which is provided by OpenCV. And then we'll try to see whether we, uh, it will recognize my face and it will unlock the, unlock the app application or not. So to begin with, here is the code. What we are going to do is that, first of all, I'm going to load this R casket face classifier. And then here I'm going to read my frames. From this, when I'm reading my frames, each and every frame I'm storing in this folder, which is like faces slash user. So you can also write your own folder names. And what I'm doing for each and every count, since I want 100 frames, you can see that I've given a condition like if 100 is equal to three, I'm going to break from there. Okay, so what I'm going to do, 100 different images I'm going to store in this folder, which will be my training data. And this uh, resizing and all, I'm doing it because I just want to take my face structure. So don't worry about this code guys, I'll be providing this code uh, in the GitHub link. So to begin with, let us go and collect our sample data, which will be used as a training data. So I'm going to execute this whole line of code and let's see. You can see that over here, my frames are of my faces are getting captured and as soon as 100 frames get over, my particular data is ready. Now you can see that over here, inside my faces users, I have all my 100 different images. If you want to see and click onto this, you can see that. Each and every image is there. Now, after that, what I'm going to do is that, the next thing is that I'm going to use an algorithm which is called as LBH face recognizer. Let me go to that into the document of OpenCV. And this is an algorithm which will actually help you to do face recognition. If you want to read more about this particular algorithm, you can go over here and read it. Uh, it will basically convert all the images. We basically have to convert all the images into arrays and give it to this particular algorithm so that algorithm will get trained with respect to that specific image. Now, after this, what I'm going to do, I'm going to train my model. Now for training our model, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to read each and every images from that particular folder. I'm going to read that. I'm going to convert that into an array. And this is my unit type that is unit eight. And then after converting into an array, I will try to pass this and create my object of LBH face recognizer. And then I'm going to do my model training. That's it. Now you see the, the best thing about this is that when I execute this, this will hardly take around uh, two to three seconds to just train the model. Now you can see that the model has got successfully. It's just two to three seconds, max of two to three seconds. Now the next thing is that I will try to read my facial. Uh, now let us go and test whether my model is able to detect me or not. So first of all in this, only three blocks of code guys. Again, I'm going to read over here my frames. And then you can see that I'm doing model.ready. Here I have written a condition that if my confidence is greater than 75, it will show me unlock. Otherwise it will show me lock. That's it. Uh, that's the whole code about this. And here it is. I'm going to execute it and you can see it over here. As soon as I execute this, you can see that 
it is it is able to recognize my image and it is sometimes saying uh, no face found that may be because of lightning factor but if i come into the right lightning face it is saying that yes the user is uh, found and uh, it has been unlocked so uh, due to some lightning factor it may not give you an accurate result but yes now you can see that my confidence is more than 75% and it is accurate so this was about the small application where you can just create it uh, and by using face recognition that is already provided in OpenCV, you are able to unlock a computer. So I hope you like this video tutorial guys. Please do subscribe the channel if you have not done and I'll be uploading this whole code in the GitHub link so you can get it from there and try it by yourself. Thank you one and all. I'll see you in the next video.